I pledge allegiance to the flag. Veterans, first responders, and citizens who believe in a united cause gathered at Town Square in St. George on Saturday, commemorating the terrible tragedy that struck on September 11th, 20 years ago. We lost a lot of great people that day, and we lost a lot of great people from that day forward trying to defend our country, and this is, this is something that uh, we need to, to remember and, and get back to that unified country that we are. Most people remember what they were doing when terrorists hijacked four commercial jets, crashing them into the Twin Towers in New York, the Pentagon, and in a field in Pennsylvania. Altogether, 2,996 people lost their lives. I cried as I watched the towers fall and knew thousands of people had just lost their lives, including the first responders. Later, we would find out 412 to be exact. The most unimaginable of tragedies began to unfold that morning when at 8.46 a.m., American Airlines Flight 11, with 20,000 gallons of fuel and 92 passengers on board, slammed into the 93rd floor of One World Trade Center, the exact location of Fred Alger Mutual Funds. 35 employees were instantly vaporized. They roamed the streets in shock at what they witnessed. And they filled the dusty air with wails of grief and the names of those lost. While the events of 9-11 shocked the world, they also brought the country into a more unified stance. The American flag symbolizes freedom and represents patriotism. I remember America uniting. I remember the U.S. flags hanging from outside of our homes and flying from our fields. There were flags flying from the windows of our cars and our businesses. Patriotic bumper stickers, signs, buttons, and t-shirts proudly displayed our loyalty to the U.S. of A. and our solidarity as a people. Families reflect upon the need for education and supporting the American flag and patriotism. Uh, patriotism isn't saying there's nothing wrong with our country, we're the best in the world, we're number one. It's saying that this is our country, this is our land, this is our family, and we're going to protect it, we're going to stand up to make it better, we're going to improve ourselves, we're going to improve our country. We're going to work together, left, right, liberal, conservative, Democrat, Republican, we're all re Americans. It definitely means a lot because we need to make sure that <sighs> that we're teaching and training everybody what this day really meant 20 years ago and not only the um, citizens that lost their lives um, in 9-11 but also the firefighters and the police officers. We're absolutely still free and it's things like this that remind us of that. It's a good turnout and it's a good reminder for all of us to be uh, thankful for the freedoms that we do have. We must not forget that we are always only one generation from forgetting. And the message to remember is one that we should never forget. On 9-11, Melissa Anderson, Community Education News.